We've had some calls over the past week or so with viewers asking the need for Talkback 16. Well, we can just put those calls to rest in this Talkback Feedback. Welcome to Talkback Feedback, where this week the top topic is us. I'd like to know what is the purpose of Talkback 16? I hear criticism, insults, ridicule, and harassment. No news. What is the purpose of Talkback 16? Where do I begin? Besides being a cherished, albeit peculiar institution in Northeastern and Central Pennsylvania, it's also your connection to us. I mean, where else could you say this? How incompetent of your station to put on that guy getting intimate with a doorbell. Channel 16 should show some respect for your afternoon viewers. Where else would you be able to lodge a complaint like this? You have the same news on since early yesterday. You can't go out and find any news news. There's news out there. Not this other crap that you keep putting on. And where else can you get direct action from us on something like this? You can tell your weatherman that the plumes that he sees from the power plants are not in Berwick. They're in Salip Township, Luzerne County, which is outside of Chickshinny, by two miles. Correct him. Oh, let me tell you, the entire weather team has been corrected. Say it! Say it! Where? Salem Township. You're darn tootin'. You can be sure it won't happen again. But the point is, Talkback is a, a valuable resource. That's its purpose. And Talkback Feedback, well, Talkback Feedback is... And Talkback Feedback is worse. What is this doing on a news show? You too can call Talkback at 1-800-228-WNEP, and maybe next week we'll give you a little feedback. Aww.